What's up guys, it's Mark Russell, 770 Arborist Tree Service with a question about dangerous trees in Roswell, Georgia. And this is a great example of planting a tree that becomes dangerous. We're gonna be real quick on this. You guys ready? Here we go. So check this out, you guys. Look at that girdling root. Now, if you, if you want, you can look at my other video, everything you ever wanted to know about girdling roots, but we're afraid to ask, but this client sent in a video and check it out, guys, look at this. So when you have a girdling root, the root wraps around the tree and here's what's so great. Look at all the anomalous activity in the root or in the trunk. So what we're talking about with anomalous activity is that when this root, see, if you notice right in this area, this is about the same size that that plant was or that pot was when he planted this back in 03. Okay, 03, 16 years ago, this thing was buried way too deep and the root came up around the top, choked the tree out. Let's keep on looking here, okay? Buried too deep, he didn't break it. He didn't break the roots out to point straight out. On that one, it worked. This one, it uh, did all right. But on this other one that wrapped, okay? Wrapped around, it's choking the tree. So guys, look at that. Are you kidding me? 16 years old, look at that little bitty thing. It's hard to even believe. I Honestly, I can't believe that that thing is 16 years old. How on earth can that even be true? I mean that if that is actually true that like that would mean that for years this tree barely I don't know. Anyway, that's what he said. Regardless, it seems to me like that tree would have been dead. Never bury your tree never bury your trees deep. Everybody's like, "Oh, bury them nice and deep." It's good solid roots. No, dude, no. Half inch above ground. Top of the plant. Uh, top of the pot, dirt level, half inch above where you're planting it. Why? Because the feeder roots in the O layer of the soil need to just go right out of the edge of that pot and straight into the soil in the organic layer. You put them deep, it forces them to have to grow up to get oxygen and, and water. And anyway, so this is, that's it. That's the example of why you don't, number one, bury too deep. And two, why you make sure that those roots come out. Um, and not wrap around. So we offer tree service in Roswell, Georgia, Sandy Springs in our new location. Um, if you guys have any questions at all, please feel free, send me a video and I will more than happy give you some commentary, give you some thoughts. My recommendation on that particular tree, time to nix it because you're gonna have tons of decay in that trunk. You might as well start from scratch, start with a fresh tree, start with one that you're not gonna get a super bad cankers in the trunk and cause a safety issue in the future. If you guys have any questions, give us a call, 770-ARBREST, 770-272-6747, and send me your videos so I can make a video and answer some questions. Okay, guys, you guys take it easy. Bye-bye.